Dinosaurs attack. Yes, indeed, everyone. Tragic here to open up Dinosaurs attack uh, by Tops. I had a lot of fun opening up Mars attacks. Uh, it's so much fun that I actually made a little binder and a collection out of it. What a nerd, right? So uh, this was suggested to me that uh, Dinosaurs Attack also exists. It's from 1988. The Mars Attacks was from the 60s, so this was Tops just reaching for the next possibility. I don't think this really took off, but it, it existed at one point. Um, this box was pretty cheap. It was probably not more than 20 bucks to get the whole um, bunch of packs here. So I'm going to try to come up with the whole set of this and put it into a binder and just have some fun. So if you're interested in this kind of stuff, stick around and uh, let me know what you think down below. Uh, five cards, one sticker, one stick of bubble gum, which is well over 30 years old. I'm not going to be eating it. I've done that before. It is not smart. Check it out. So, okay, we got a sticker. We got a Triceratops. Like, I am literally 12 years old again. And uh, you know what? I'm okay with that. The truth about Triceratops. There's a bunch of uh, facts and things. And we will put that in the sticker pile. So, we're going to put a, uh, as, as I want to build a set, I'm going to keep the checklist. So, it looks like 54 car, 55 cards, including the checklist. So, there we go. That will get us started here. Prometheus Explodes, number 53. And uh, there will be a, a big story on the back. Oh, wow, that's interesting. Destruct Sequence 32, Nuclear Furnace Overload, right? So in the end, I'll be able to assemble this as a story and, uh, and enjoy it at my leisure. Uh, but for now, I'm just going to kind of go through and try to get a whole set here. Number four, The Past Comes Alive. Yeah, I had never seen this before really getting into uh, the non-sports stuff. That's cool. It's like a like a newspaper uh, headline. C-Card 5, Homeroom Horror. I guess it just directs you to the next one. Very funny. So I'll put these into an order that I can deal with them later. Whoa, trapped in the basement. People just getting eaten by dinosaurs. Yeah, the Mars attacks was a little gruesome. And uh, <laughs> this is more of the same. So help us we're trapped in the basement oh my gosh that's pretty funny stuff if you ask me ripped out of time so there must have been a way for the humans to fight back against the dinosaurs much like the martians uh there was just like a whole story arc they came and attacked and there was a big fight and a bunch of um gore <laughs> happened and then the humans won in the end so i imagine it's the same so uh, let's make a little couple of piles here so I can sort them out later. Here's a red pack. Uh, there's like no premiums or chase cards or anything like that back in the 80s and uh, beyond that. It was just about selling this kind of stuff to kids. Yeah, definitely let your kids see an Allosaurus rip a guy's head off. Um, just like Mars Attacks, parents of the day probably would have just taken these away if they saw them. Mine certainly would have. Oh my gosh. Our force is flattened. This guy it looks like a Chinese guy. General or something is uh, not doing well. Fast food frenzy. The burger barn is getting destroyed. Hilarious. Lunchbreakers face sudden death. That they do. So for later, I'm going to go through these and try to assemble a set so I'm going to put them into some kind of order here. Trilobite Terror. Yeah. Those things are getting him. And yep, yeah, it just tells you that the next one is Wrestling Riot. Homeroom Horror. Gruesome. Students and substitute teacher eaten alive. Well, good thing the teacher was out that day. Monster in the Museum. So, the dinosaur is just eating dinosaur fossils. I would think that they probably still want some meat. There's that gum. Snap. It's done for. There we go. Might actually come up with a couple of base sets. This is, well, there's not a insert set either in this box, but... Uh, there's plenty of packs. Stegosaurus, number eight for the sticker. 
Cover Lizard. We can't hold them back. The official dispatch from the U.S. Army. That's number 38. The time scanner disaster. So is that how they got here? Some time travel problems. Isn't that always how it is? Panic in the stadium. Yeah, that's a problem. You can't play baseball when you're getting mauled to death by dinosaurs. I always say coasting to calamity. <laughs> that's really funny. The roller coaster right in the mouth. I don't know. Crushing a canine. This is how Mars Attacks was too. There was a, a, a dog getting killed. Terrible. Oh no, the nuptial nightmare is, is next. Alright. This is what we're doing here, people. Uh, let's see, we got a Triceratops is goring the police. That's problems right there. Blue Water Savage Death. That shark has no chance against this. It's a weird looking dinosaur. It's got ears. Alright, that is number 17. Italy under siege. Just knocking over the Tower of Pisa. Number 10. Rebuilding our world. So this is the very end. The, the world has been devastated by the dinosaur menace. And that's the end of the story there. Oh my gosh, it's funny. How ironic. <laughs> uh, I'm going to read that all properly later in order, I think. Madness in the streets. This blind guy does not know what is what he's in for. The city goes bonkers as attacks continue. Supreme Evil. That's not just a dinosaur there. That's that's more than just some time travel stuff happening. You guys got six eyes. So there's somehow the dinosaurs have mutated into some kind of demon things. Problem. So, of course, Mars Attacks was made into a movie. I, I, this one probably was been on the back burner for a long time when it comes to movies. I don't know if it will ever see the light of day in that way. Probably just not popular enough. I had never even really heard of it. Brontosaurus. Yeah, Brontosaurus was supposed to be a, a herbivore, right? They wouldn't. They wouldn't just eat people off the street, would they? You can't let them win. Oh, you got to sacrifice a pawn to win the game, apparently. Comics Con Catastrophe. Some nerds getting getting mauled for their comic books. Oh, there's an actual comic on the back. And a New York hotel and a steam comic book artist shares his views. Comics are more than just kid stuff. They reflect real life. <laughs> he gets chomped by a dinosaur. <laughs> irony. It's just the irony is thick right there. I love it. Grip of horror. Yeah, that that dinosaur hand looks like more than more than a dinosaur hand. It's like a human hand almost. Yeah, what is going on here? Sorry and secrets. Wow. Yeah, I've really got to know the whole story of this. What is this guy? Uh, there's a whole log. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff to read there. I'm gonna move on. I'll, I'll get to it later. Dinosaurs attack cards and stickers. So this is almost just like an advertisement. Or is this the number one card it says one right there so I'll throw that in here and we'll put it into the binder later if that is indeed the correct one <clears throat> you guys this stuff is fun for me I hope it's fun for you if you're watching still at this point um, then I appreciate it and you must be into this so hey here we are plesiosaurus chomping a guy in half in the diving suit there and uh, the, the facts there don't talk about killing humans, so that must not be a fact. Day of the duck bill. The hunter made a terrible miscalculation there. Uh, Anchorman's peril. So far, I haven't seen really any duplicates. Gruesome fate. What is going on there? I don't know what happened there. I guess I'll have to, I'll have to read it. I'm 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 compelled to read it. London in flames. That's pretty bad right there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Chaos ensues. It really does. Twenty-four. Picnic apparel. I think we had seen no, we haven't seen this one yet. The boom box is telling you the bad news. Funny. 
Okay, that's a duplicate. We've seen the shark before. Blue water, savage death. So I'm going to put my duplicate over here. Yeah, Italy under siege. We've seen that one. Rebuilding our world. We've seen that one. Madison. So this, this pack, I think, is an actual duplicate pack. And here's another Stegosaurus. Okay. So that's probably how this goes. There's probably certain packs have the same cards in them. Oh, there's gum stuck on the back. So uh, let's see. We got an Allosaurus. That is a duplicate. DC Holocaust. So that one's new. Soviets versus Dimetrodons. Those dang Soviets. They don't know what they're in for. Kind of looks like, like they're doing pretty good, actually. The Americans weren't doing so well. Leave it to the Ruskies to fix it for us, right? Comrade. Nuptial Nightmare. Uh, we haven't seen this one yet. The Saurian Secret. So there's a wedding reception, but it's got some blood spots on the back unfortunate the Saurian secrets that is a duplicate and then this one the forward is a duplicate so oh there's another copy of the sharks ah but this is new so the packs are not identical rock concert carnage <laughs> oh no it tore his heavy metal hair right off who are these guys that's hilarious. Oh my gosh. So that's number 13. Bashing the BMT. Is that, uh, is that like an English thing? Number 20. Wrestling Riot. They're actually wrestling a dinosaur. How would it even get up to the ring without them knowing it? Oh my gosh. Isn't that... Okay, so thinking way back to the 80s, I think that might be an actual real wrestling announcer guy. Gene, is that his name? I'm not sure. Tell me down below. was not that big of a wrestling fan. Lunch break. Those poor kids, they're just in a snack box right there in the, lunch, in the uh, school bus. Oh my gosh, that's funny. I might have to play uh, Rampage on my arcade mach channel in uh, honor of this set. Check out High Score Arcade up there. Another Dimetrodon. So I'll, I'll definitely have a full sticker set here. Time to die. That's unfortunate. The past comes alive. I think I saw this one before. That's a duplicate. Trapped in the basement. We've seen this one. Ripped out of time. The Ultimate Sacrifice. That's a new one. 52. And then Heartland Horror. Number 16. Whoops. There we go. Parasolophus. Eating a baby. That's just, that was not going to fly in my parents' house, I'll tell you that much. The Behemoth Fries. Number 22. Experiment in Space. So this is number 2. If that, if the advertisement card is number one then this would be the first part of the story I think I haven't seen another number one card yet lights camera carnage the guy's in a dinosaur costume for Godzilla movie that's really funny it's even in Japanese Gadzuka that's great number 42 cat lady's revenge that cat lady's packing some power there with that shotgun Lose eye right off. We're 32. These are great. Entombed. What in the world happened there? He phased through the dinosaur? That's bizarre. Okay, there must be a big story behind that. I'll have to get to that. Pteranodon. Oh my gosh. Past comes alive. Time Twister. Okay, yeah, so they must. This is the number 51, so it's nearing the end. They must have. They sent them back through time or something. Back, back, back through the long centuries they are sent. Some are whole, others are twisted lumps of flesh and bone. 
all are hurling to their point of origin in the Mesozoic Age. That's how you get rid of dinosaurs. You send them back in time. Obviously. The business launch. Who's this guy? He's telling you the story. Meltdown. Oh my gosh. Some more kind of like live action photos. That's really funny. 44. And the Heartland Horror. Did we see this one? I don't think we saw. Oh, yeah, there it is right there. Yeah, so. Kind of getting to the point where I think I've got almost all of them. I'll have to kind of stop and see which ones I'm missing. Again with the gum, the parasol office, trilobite, homeroom. We've seen these. The museum, the synopsis with the checklist, and the Prometheus explodes. I think we saw this one. Gonna let me double check. Is it in the 50s? Yep, we've got the we got all of those in the 50s. All right, real quick. Oh my gosh, the gum is everywhere. I'm just gonna count these up and see like how close did I get. So. It's a two, nine, seven, so that's one, ten, eight, three, four, five. So I need a number six, so there's there is more to go here. Whoops. Ow. Let's see here. There's the Comic Con again. Grip of Horror, Manhattan Island Swamp. Yeah, that's a new one. Number 33. There's no escape from tropical hell. Not what they always say. The Colonel gets shredded. Number 15. The official army dispatch. Prometheus again. And a Pteranodon sticker. The gum goes over there. Another pteranodon. Bashing the BMT. We saw that. The wrestling. Lunch break. Flattened. Fast food frenzy. So we had all of those. Oh my gosh. Okay. Trachodon. That's a new sticker, I think. Gruesome Fate, London in Flames, Flattened. Yep, yeah, starting to see more and more duplicates. I think there are a few still that we're missing. This game here, Coasting to Calamity. Crushing a Canine, we got that. There we go, six is Police Precinct Assaulted. Yep, and there we go. Lady in Distress, that's a new one. Statue of Liberty. That's like the cover of the box, 35. So, Rock Concert and a Tyrannosaurus sticker. That's a new one, too. So, I think I've almost got a complete set. I'm probably going to stop here so I can actually start putting them into the uh, binder. I think that's enough. You guys seen enough, right? Um... Looks like I'm going to probably have some packs left over. I may put these up onto my eBay store for real cheap. So if anyone's really interested, um, send me a message on eBay or at tragicmtg at gmail.com. And uh, if you're interested in any of this stuff, we'll make a little deal. It'll be cheap. Trust me. Uh, everyone, thanks for watching. Um, check out my other stuff. Watch my arcade channel. Do the things. Catch you later.